And now let me get you my interview with Rani Mukherjee. Well, we got talking about Talash, about Amir Khan, Kareena Kapoor, Yash Chopra, and of course Adi Chopra. Tune in. पिछले तीन चार साल से उसी रोड पे ऐसे कई एक्सीडेंट्स हुए हैं कुछ समझ में नहीं आया कुछ सबूत भी नहीं मिला with me one and only Rani Mukherjee and Rani is actually on some talash actually how are you doing first of all I'm doing okay how are you Lana I'm doing very well and shining and you're looking fresh like an apple <laughs> you know what do you what does one do when one of the biggest superstars flirts with you on air you just blush so I'm like hi I'm sorry anyway so how have you been really your cheeks are like glowing what's happening aloe vera in the morning with honey ओके मैं थानी आई जस्ट क्या हो रहा हूं मैं आज भी हानी रियली सो सो मॉर्निंग राइटिंग इज कंप्लीट बट नाउ लेट्स टॉक अबाउट तलाश यू नो इट्स रिलीजिंग यू नो लॉट ऑफ एक्सपेक्टेशंस यू आर कमिंग बैक विद आमिर खान अम व्हाट डू वी रियली सी यू डूइंग इन तलाश एक्चुअली कांट स्पीक मच अबाउट द फिल्म एज यू ऑल नो दैट इट बीइंग अ सस्पेंस ड्रामा वी बीन टोल्ड नॉट टू टॉक टू मच अबाउट द फिल्म और द कैरेक्टर बिकॉज़ आई गेस व्हेन यू एक्सप्लेन समथिंग अबाउट अ कैरेक्टर देन इट लीड्स टू अनदर थिंग uh so i wouldn't like to be the person to spoil anybody's suspense was <laughs> kaksan tha suri wo aksara nahi la par rahi thi meri tumhare bare mein baatein ho rahi hai jo tumhare kareeb ki bilkul achhi nahi hai kiske saath rehte ho raat bhar pyar ho gaya kya mujhse sab pata nahi kya ho raha hai mujhe lagta hai sare jawab mere samne hain lekin mujhe nazar nahi aa rahe but yes i think it's a very very special film for me because obviously i'm working with amir after a gap of 7 years the last time i worked with him was on rising um and amir as i've always said in all my interviews whether he's been part of my films or not being part of those films i think in all my interviews i've always said that he's somebody who i've learned a lot from he's somebody i started my career with and of course so uh, because i worked with him in the beginning at such an impressionable age i think he made a huge impact in my life you know professionally and i'm happy to be back uh, doing a film with him and amir is lost like how many cuts are right Yeah, I mean, um, you know, we were reading in the paper the other day, you know, where you said that how um, um, yes, she used to call you the Bengali tigress. And what is your fondest memory? Where you are concerned? My fondest memory is again. I think I just remember him <coughs> just. Um, you know calling me uh, during mujhse dosti karoge he was obviously the producer on set so he used to come and he had come during the uh, shooting scene in switzerland and we were shooting in the uh, uh, those famous switzerland uh, open <laughs> mountain areas and me and rithik were doing some shot and you know karina was also there we were shooting a song and i just hear yashangal calling out to me and karina and idhar aao bachche idhar aao and also we run to him and he's got the strawberry and cream with him and he's like chalo bachche strawberry aur cream khao and we have kunal bhi and shouting nahi nahi wo mote ho jayenge and he's like no no koi mote hote nahi hote and he used to feed us strawberry and cream during the shoot of mujhse dosti karoge in the last question um the fact that you know um, it, it's actually it's out there right now that you know you have been there um is is there any formalization of relationship can we expect you know uh, with you and adi we are not going to talk anything apart from talash now <laughs> okay fine last question then november 30th talash comes what next for you uh what next for me not decided as yet because i think uh, i have not yet come across a script that has excited me enough to do um and uh, basically i'll be waiting for something that comes worth my while so that i can not uh, um disillusion my fans because they expect a lot out of me so i'm still waiting for that great script and that great role to come my way okay well on that note guys we'll actually have to let go of rani and uh, we only wish and hope that her talash actually on november 30th turns out to be a brilliant success rani all the very best and thank you very much for talking to us